How's it going everybody and welcome back to another video. Now before I actually get into what I want to talk about today and help you guys go from 0 to 100,000 coins uh, with set example and proof, what I have on screen at the moment are just three players, two players actually, three cards that I recommended investing in in yesterday's video. We have Ibrahimovic, 200,000 coins, and we have two Inform Iniestas, all 89 overalls. At the moment, in uh, I believe Ibra is going for about 220, 230,000 coins, and he's just bound to go up. Because if you guys don't know, the team of the week, uh, this team of the week that's currently out, is uh, very poor in my opinion. The highest rated player is Danny Alves at 85. Definitely a good card. Really good investment, so if you guys do have the coins, I'd recommend come Saturday or Sunday, invest your coins in Danny Alves, he will go up. And aside from that, we made about 30,000 coins on Zlatan Ibrahimovic. We bought two Iniestas, one for 220,000, the other for 231,000, and this is where the profit comes in, because at the moment, you guys can see his cheapest buy now is about 250, 260,000 coins, so we made a minimum of about 20 to 30,000 coins on both cards. Now that being said, this is just like an outcome of yesterday's video, I just want to show you guys, if you invested your coins and you sniped some players, uh, you probably could have made a good 100,000 coins as I made right here. So the method you guys are actually going to be seeing on screen on how I went from 0 to 100,000 coins was very simple. Obviously you had been sniping back then, and this is all I was doing, just to share my secrets with you guys. I did this with the Iniesta, I did this with the Ibrahimovic, uh, just amazing, amazing profit being made from this method it's simple you guys have probably heard about it from other places I started off small this is when FIFA first came out I started off small uh, by purchasing Sizoko for about anywhere in between 4,000 and uh, zero coins so at times you guys can see right here I bought him for 3,300 and I would later sell him on for about 65 to 7,000 coins it was a very simple method it still works on certain players uh, in all honesty you just have to have fast fingers see one popped up for 57 but the profit on that would have been very minimal now you guys might be wondering why show previous examples, why show examples of when the game first came out and the market was new and fresh. Uh, it's to just show you guys that you guys can really make 100,000 coins doing anything. I did this with the Ibra and I did this with the Iniestas that I purchased uh, the exact same thing. I just sniped them uh, as soon as they were out of packs and I was very fortunate to get them for such a low price and overnight I made 100,000 coins like that. And when the game first came out, this is how I was making 100,000 coins. I do have quite a bit of coinage on me at the moment just very hesitant on spending it just waiting to invest it uh, so all in all find a player that you can afford find a player that you can stick with do it with silver players bronze players any player in general you just want to go to those players that you feel that you have a gut feeling that their price will go up now Sizoko is just one of those players 78 overall nobody would really assume that he's worth 7,000 coins at the start of the game even I was surprised however he was just one of those players his price tag did not match his skill and his ability for his card. Now that being said, hopefully this video helped you guys out. Hopefully you guys can take my word for it. Just invest in Team of the Week players and at the same time, just invest in players that you have a gut feeling will go up in price. Now, thank you guys for watching. It's been Toxic here. Hopefully you guys did enjoy and I'm out of here guys. See ya. Peace.